Good morning, everybody. It's time for another grant update. Uh, so, so far, uh, not a whole lot. Um, she was admitted. Uh, she is doing much better. I know Bob gave her a phone call yesterday and, and uh, probably agrees with me that she uh, seems to be much better. Her mental uh, faculties are better. Uh, so she, um, out of the blue, of course, uh, now that she has her phone, she texted me this morning asking me what the status was and when she would be released. Um, she told me a couple of days ago, <clears throat> or excuse me, uh, yesterday when we talked that, uh, that she heard that she needed to be there for 72 hours. Now I haven't heard anything from the staff at her new facility, um, uh, except for one phone call they called me to get some clarification on on uh, insurance stuff <clears throat> but no real plan about how uh, this is going to go or when she would be released so i called today uh, and asked um the person who i needed to speak to I, I think her name is monica she was in a meeting they told me to call back at 10 which was just a couple of minutes ago and i did call back uh there she monica did not uh, respond to her page so i left her a voicemail hopefully in the next uh, few minutes I'll get some more uh, details about how this is going. Um, I'm encouraged by the fact that mom is obviously using her phone and reaching out and, and making phone calls and is, understands where she is and knows she doesn't want to be there anymore. So all of these things are good signs. Uh, when I spoke to her on the phone, um, she is better. Uh, you know, she's not uh, she, the way she was when she was 40, but who is? Um, <clears throat> so she's, uh, but I think she's doing much better. I, I foresee her moving out relatively soon. Um, there's not a whole lot to report, but I figured I'd make a video anyway just to kind of keep you informed. And as soon as I hear something more, I'll let you know more. See you guys later.